Alright guys, got another radio back from the past. I had these about 10, 10 years or so ago. I bought from a fellow out in uh, Clarenville actually. I bought this 6 meter Yeezu FT620B and a Tentec Argosy 525 Delta, which I also now have back in my possession. Um, I think I paid like 350 bucks for both of the radios. It was a bit of a steal to say the least. Not bad, but uh, so yeah, I made a few contacts with this six meter radio back then. Um, made a few contacts with people in the states. Uh, made a couple of contacts here in Canada. Um, you know, locally I guess, and I've also made a few from the maritime provinces, including Ontario. And the most first station I managed to contact with this six meter radio uh, ten years ago was 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 a station in the Canary Islands. Um, at the time, I was only using a dipole antenna, so uh, and it was roughly about twenty feet off the ground, so it worked quite well. And uh, for whatever reason, I decided to get rid of the uh, FT or the Azo FT six twenty B. And I sold it or traded it to another friend of mine uh, years ago. And um, the transmitter or the output stage has since failed. Right now, there's very little power being generated by the radio. Uh, later today, I'll be putting her on a service monitor and seeing what exactly she is putting out. Um, I'm also going to be changing the, uh, the driver and the final in this radio. The driver for the Yezu 620B is a 2SC1306 uh, I believe it is and the output is a 2SC1307 uh, I believe that's what they are it's the same, the same outputs that are in the old uh, CB radios the old 58 boards, 858 the TRC449 um, this 620B it does not put out any more power in the CB radio. <laughs> she only does about 12 watts sideband maximum. And you can tell that by the uh, by the meter in her. She does between 10 and 12 watts maximum power output. That's as much as she does. You want to see any more than that, then, you, uh, then you've got to run her through an amplifier. So anyways, um, today I'm going to be replacing the two transistors in her and uh, the, the driver in the final. Uh, I'm going to be scrounging them from a working sideband radio I have here because at the moment I'd rather have the 620B working so that's the plan. Um, hopefully with the new driver and final this radio will get back up to snuff and work as it should. Um, in the meantime I'll just uh, throw this video out there. Um, this will be a small series of videos um, it could be lengthy, depending on what I come up with with the uh, with the uh, the transmitter section. So, anyway, guys, um, if you're interested in uh, learn a little bit about the Yezu FT620 dB, then uh, I'd uh, take a look at the series of next series of videos that I'll be making on this radio. So, this will be part one, just doing a little overview of the radio. So, there you go. So, basically, we have AM carrier. That's your power control. Uh, you have your band selection here. She goes from 50 to 54 megahertz. Uh, you have your clarifier control. You have your uh, mode selection here, including your power. So power, AM, uh, CW, upper and lower sideband. Um, over here you have VFO. And she also got pre precision um, that you can put crystals inside of her for pre-selected channels. So she has channel 4, 1, 2, 3, and 4. She also got a mic gain control up here. You got your pre-selector that uh, also tunes your receive as well as your transmitter. So you just uh, tweak this, your pre-selector, and it'll tune up your receive and transmit at the same time. Then, of course, you have your, uh, your volume control. Um, this one do not have any... Uh, it does have a, a, a noise blanker. There's no A and L that I know of, but it has noise blanker. You turn on noise blanker. You just pull that knob, 
and then noise blink your lamp. To clear a fire, do work. It also has a uh, marker every 100 hertz. Uh, I believe it worked, I thought it did. Anyway, so right now there's two CW stations that you can hear, but both of them are beacons. And the other one that you heard earlier, right at the bottom of the bed. So anyways, just thought I'd throw this video up there and uh, look for some videos on this uh, radio soon. Anyway guys, all the best and take care.